Today, I'm gonna show you what your baby experiences in the womb. Like, is it completely dark in there? Can they hear you talk? Can your baby feel outside temperature changes? Do they pass gas in there? Do they cry in there? All this and more coming up. This is The Paternal Partner. Hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our future content. At week 32, they often sleep 95% of the time. So even when they're moving around, they're still likely asleep. Your baby's first sense is touch around week eight. That's a pretty important sense to have to be able to quickly pull away from dangers like heat and sharpness. I mean, you've seen how babies have zero qualms about attempting to climb dangerous stairs or touching electrical outlets. But an acute sense of touch can protect your baby from immediate unknown dangers around week 16 your baby will feel you touching her stomach. And soon they're gonna start responding with little kicks or even by curling up in the palm of your hand. Try it. Taste buds, they start to develop around week 11, right as the mouth opens up. Your baby can taste most of mom's food from then on. Is that bacon? Some flavors like vanilla, carrot, garlic, mint, They've been shown to be particularly easily transmitted into amniotic fluid. Some people believe that it'll make your baby prefer foods consumed during pregnancy later in life. Around week 16, some of the first sounds are able to be heard by your baby in the womb. But by week 24, those ears are fully developed. Many babies will then turn their heads in response to certain sounds. A popular thing a lot of new parents do is to play Mozart to their baby in the womb. But there's no strong evidence that Mozart in particular does anything unique. So you might as well play your favorites. The uterus is pretty noisy. There's a lot going on in her body and a lot of outside sounds make it through. This may explain why some babies find noise so comforting. So do yourself a favor and get your new baby used to sounds while they sleep. It is much easier to keep a loud household when that baby's sleeping than a silent one. But be sure to avoid prolonged, excessively loud noises above 115 decibels. But you know, a night out on the town isn't gonna hurt. Can you hear a baby cry in the womb? While it's true that your baby can cry in the womb, it doesn't make a sound. They're just practicing. <laughs> How did he eat your food? Even though the wiring's all in its necessary place earlier, it's only after week 28 that your baby can finally smell through the amniotic fluid. And to answer your question, I know you're dying to hear, no. Babies don't fart in utero. For anyone, including babies to pass gas, they need to ingest air, of which there is none in the womb. Vision, it's the last sense to develop in your unborn baby. By week 22, it's possible to perceive light. The uterus is a surprisingly luminous place, kind of like being in a room where the lights are switched off during the day and the curtains are drawn. Soon, your baby's eyelids will open and even begin to blink. <laughs> At week 32, your baby can then track a flashlight moved across mom's belly. It's gonna get very cramped near the end, but your baby's been working hard developing those senses for the moment they finally break free. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. We post new content here every week, stuff no one tells you about being a dad. Hit that subscribe button below and the little bell icon too so you don't miss out on any of our future content.